Welcome back to another episode of the Penny Hunt and Fill. I stopped at two different Chase banks and got four rolls of pennies from each. I'm going to be opening these four first, and these were the same bank that I got a wheat penny from the teens for the Bank Battle series. And then these are from a different Chase bank. But we're going to start with these here because I did get a 1914. I think it was a 1914. With some coin from the teens for the bank battle series i already checked the enders there's nothing special here so far this roll isn't looking too good for wheat pennies I don't see any, but I'll go through these a little bit closer now. We got 1961 Denver. I've been buying so many rolls of wheat pennies and hunting through those that I forgot what it's like to go through a normal roll. We got 1969 Philadelphia. Two coins from the 60s so far. All right, I'm just gonna open all four of them now and then I'll hunt for varieties and errors after I get all four open. But once again, not looking too great. That's a 1990. We got a 1959 and a 1963. That's a San Francisco. I don't... Wait, no. Yeah, that does look like it's San Francisco. It's a San Francisco 1963. I don't know if that's a proof, though. Let's open another one. I'm hoping to get at least one wheat penny from this bank. We have one more roll to open after this one. We got 1966, Philadelphia. We got 1964, Denver. I don't know if this was a collector because I did find the 1959. And I think a lot of collectors do take the 59s out. We got 1969, Denver. Better condition. We got 1969, Denver. Last roll to open from this bank, but we do have another bank to open. We have four rolls of pennies from two banks. Please have a wheat penny. It does it look like it's going to. But let's find out. We got a dime in this roll. It's a 1970, but it's still a dime in a penny roll. We did get another 1959. This one's a Denver. We got 1963, Denver. We got 1963, Philadelphia. Let's go through these last couple here. 1998, 2021, 2013, 1994, and 2017. Now, I need to go through all these pennies to see if there's any errors or varieties. All right, time to open the rolls from the other Chase Bank. I did find one 2009 as I finished the hunt. No errors and no varieties though from that bank. But I'm hoping we get a wheat penny here. But through this fast look, I don't see any. We got 1963 Denver. We got 1968 Denver. We got 1960 Philadelphia. Only three coins in that roll. I'm hoping that these are from a different bank that they have wheat pennies in them. We got 1961 Denver though. We got 1969 Denver. Let's open this roll now. I'm hoping these were brought in from a different customer. So they might have some wheat pennies in them if the other rolls were from collectors. We did get a 1966, a 1969 Denver, and a 1963. This is the last roll to open. I'm hoping that it had some wheat pennies or something good in it. We got no wheat pennies, but we got a 1960 Denver and a 1967. 
We did, however, get a 2009. So one from the first bank and one from the second. Let me go and do an area variety search on all these. And then I'll be back to see if there's any additions or upgrades to the book. Although we know that there are no additions to the book. We're going to be upgrading the 1969 Philadelphia. Just because there's some damage on the bottom of that one. And there's no damage on that one. This 1912 Denver is a slight upgrade, but I'm still going to be upgrading it.